Shalom guys, hope that you are doing wonderful. I'm here to do a general daily reading for you. If you are returning, welcome back guys. I'm glad to have you back and uh, thanks for being a part of this channel and all of that. Those of you who are new, welcome to my channel. It can be an intense channel. Um, it could come across churchy and religious. I'm not. Uh, the scripture is in the tarot and uh, a lot of people know that, a lot of people don't. It, uh, it's my life and I keep covenant with you the Elohim maker of heaven and earth people call him the universe got many names about him um, but uh, I'm for uprightness and, and this channel looks at criminal activity most of the time just to uproot it see what's going on what could possibly be around you uh, things like that things that people have already been through um, so we just look at all kinds of stuff here, and we don't put the spirit in box like I said, and uh, so anyway, it is what it is. I use homemade decks, the runes, um, the tarot, just whatever. We don't need any of this for the great uh, Elohim to speak, but uh, this is how he uses me in the earth, and so anyway, this is who I am. If you stay, you stay. You'll learn me as we go. If not, then thanks for checking me out. So. We're going to look at the last 24 hours and now and then the next 24 hours for uh, whoever Jehovah wants to bring information um, to and for whatever purpose it's coming out. Okay, so Jehovah, I just invite your presence here. I just thank you for clear to find messages. Jehovah, rebuke and bind and block every foul, wicked, dark energy. I inquire at your hand and your hand alone. I thank you for Yeshua. I thank you for the spirit of prophecy. I thank you for righteousness because you do speak things that are right. I ask for your wisdom uh, to just guide uh, this message. Go before us. Prepare the way. You'll have a rebuke every foul, wicked, dark energy that would try to harm anyone in any kind of way, shape, or form. Give answers to the one who needs it and uh, direction today to all of us. Order us by your word, Yehovah. All right. Show me the last 24 hours, please. Sweet Elohim of life and truth. Okay, some type of communication went down for somebody uh, in the last 24 hours. We're going to we're gonna take some cards on these. Um, I'm not just taking it just for what's on the card. We will take, I mean, for some people it's positive communication. For some people it, it probably wasn't. For some, um, some type of communication is here though within some matter. Okay, and so in the now, we have somebody who's dealing with somebody who's got addictions. Okay, well, so obviously something's happened and uh, somebody's somebody's got some type of a snakish situation going on. Show me the next 24 hours. There's somebody who needs help. So there's some type of conflict here showing up. Okay, um, somebody's needing some guidance within a matter. Okay. We got somebody here, I've pointed this out before, in the face of somebody else who's got an addiction, trying to talk to somebody about something. We've got, in the next 24 hours, the conflict card saying you need to walk away from something. So whatever this conversation was about, what, whatever is going on, somebody's got a beast upon them in a very bad, freakish way. So let's see what this communication is. Because in the now, somebody's got some stuff. I'm also seeing somebody trying to give somebody an evil eye. If you look at this, there's stuff coming out of the eyes and stuff like that. Somebody's an enchanter or something like that, possibly. Uh, thinking that they're going to control somebody. And uh, somebody just needs to stand in the truth around some stupidness. That's crazy. Somebody needs help with an addiction. So, there's some type of communication about death issues are here. The death card and the five of cups is here. This is a disappointment card. Somebody was disappointed in somebody's communication. Maybe possibly they were. Uh, some type of a transformation about when well, something just died altogether. Just energetically, physically, emotionally, spiritually. Some type of a... A situation is here or you know it's it, you know somebody has tried to communicate I want to turn around take these cups and in something that was going on and in the now there's some type of real addiction going on with somebody and they thought that something was what what it was a lie 
somebody says, I want to I want to come back, I want to turn around, I want to take these cups, and somebody allowed that to happen, let some type of a rebirth within some situation happen, and now they're in a place that, oh my God, this person is just, they got, they got freakish addictive something here, then for some people that might be the case, okay, so show me this, show me this addiction card, please, Jehovah. Because we're seeing a conflict over here that somebody's going to have to walk away from in the next 24 hours. Or it's going to be resolved. I mean, d depending on who you are, what you are. Um, there's third parties here with the three of wands. Some type of trading. Trying to manifest ideas. We have the magician here. Okay, well, somebody's got a addiction problem. Then we have a physician in the now as well. There's a manipulation card in the negative since we see snakes here and we also have the um the knight of pentacles this is about loyalty situations okay some some type of a loyalty situation is here if that's work then i guess that's work somebody very skilled in what they do and somebody again if they're an enchanter then we got a magician here put a little spell on you type of energy if that's what happened because somebody's in the occult back here for some people that would be the case because that that house if you go look at that will take you back to the occult okay if somebody's got snakes in their face they've got loyalty situations going on there's a manipulator here somebody trying to lay down some type of new foundation there's somebody who leads clans of people. This is a sea of people when the death card comes out in the Hebrew. And so somebody's trying to fight and, and get some virtue, then that's great. If you're getting help, that's great. Uh, you know, if it's possible for somebody to get healed, then then great. If you haven't passed the line back here and put some children through the fire and some stupidness, um, there, there, there's some, some type of trading going on with the three of uh, wands. Okay? What's the trading about? You'll hold up. What is this in the now? Somebody needs to be just as skilled to deal with somebody who is dealing with this crap. Okay? Just as skilled. And somebody trying to manipulate something here. Some freak needs to be taken down. Very, and so that the conflict can go away. There needs to be a resolution to some type of stupid conflict in the next 24 hours. It's in the now. Somebody trying to lay down some type of a conflict. It's showing it. Yes. It's somebody, mine, 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 mine. Somebody has uh, stole some pentacles and did some stupid here. They're trying to trade something. That's five pentacles. You ain't going to throw nobody out, fool. You ain't going to throw nobody out, you fool. Stop doing that to people, you freak. You're a manipulator. You're a nasty person to do that to any. You don't have no virtue if you ain't going to lay something down. That's crazy. That that's a, that's a power card. I'm controlling this thing. By God, somebody communicated something here. And it just, my God, somebody just, they're, they're crazy. Somebody's a freak out here. Yes, yeah, some type of a Cupid's arrows and somebody's throwing some type of, again, I'm hearing an enchanter. Somebody's just trying to enchant somebody. Somebody got some type of freakish uh, situation around them and they're, they're a, there's a beast here. People, this is a cursed thing. Somebody is not loyal somewhere. A judgment for bestiality. Well, you could make it up, and you should never make it up because Job can speak for himself. If somebody's under judgment for that crap. Somebody's communicated something here about the past or some type of death situation or, or whatever's taking place back here. Transformed everything because somebody is in the occult and does some stupidness. With They lay down with the beast. They did something stupid. They're crazy. All right, whatever the crap that has been, that's nastiness. This person needs to be cast out. They're an abominable nasty in the earth. And somebody does not need to be talking to this thing. There's nothing that you could say to this person that's going to change anything. There's a judgment for this crap. Somebody's gross. That's It's beyond a uh, physician. Okay, it's a, this person's still, still trying to manipulate something here because they got a beast. 
If you're dealing with somebody who uh, has had some type of a disturbance by water, we have somebody crying here by water than you are. This is a sea, this goes back to the sea and the rain and that kind of stuff. All right, so there's been some type of a disturbance then by some, we already know it. It was probably a float trip some people it was or something like that so the bus stop in the subway so then therefore we got we got the emperor energy so if you are new i've got so many videos so many videos that when the bus stop or the subway comes out the emperor comes out that's a father figure that's a boss that's somebody's husband trying to protect something the b and the s is it's been a bunch of bs here it, it represents in the hebrew somebody just got trampled on okay there's been a disturbance here somebody got killed back here okay and that ain't okay okay something's nasty with somebody doing some stupid to a to an animal Okay, somebody trying to manipulate something because they don't want the information out. It's too bad. Your whole is calling you out. Okay, that's gross. Okay, somebody's a boss or somebody's father, somebody's husband. I, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say it because it's out here. Something happened at a bus stop. Somebody took the subway somewhere, did some stupid, nasty, freakish, gross thing. Then I guess that's what it's showing. It's profane. Get out of society. Um, there's an obligation that needs to be to the truth. Yes. And this is a liar. It's a manipulator out here. Okay. Somebody did bind somebody down and shackle them down and did something and chain them up. And somebody is chained by the beast as well. Um, there's been some type of a declaration in, in the city or the town or something like that. Also, somebody has perceived something that is going on within some matter. And... Um, Sometimes, so there is something about trampling with this energy out here. It's it's, it's here, okay. Um, there's a bar drinking energy out here as well. But Jehovah is also saying it's my turn to trample on my enemies. Is what's also on this um, on this card that came came out. So Jehovah is going to get up and trample on some freak that's got a beast upon them. They're nasty. There's third parties here involved in some stupid. Show me this conflict card, Jehovah. This person needs to be bound up. They're not even a person anymore. They might as well be called that they mixed with the beast. They did some nasty sexual thing for some that's gross. This secret sex back here. The death card go back to secret sex. Somebody secretly did some sex with some nasty. Okay? So we do have some type of real emotion out here. Or if you're going to resolve some type of conflict and cut the head of this freak off and say you don't even exist anymore. You are a, my God, you are a freak. You're hopefully going to come and with his feet and just pounce upon you now. Then this Ten of Cups is, is positive and this nastiness is out of the way. Don't care who they are. Don't even care if they're family members. As sad as that may be, people, somebody has done, they've chosen their way. Okay, that's gross. And unfortunately, people reach a point, they, they, they have their own free will. And uh, as embarrassing that might be even to family stuff, it is what it is at this point. Okay, to each their own. Okay, that's gross. They've become an enemy to the Most High at this point. Ain't no amount of communication that you can give this person. They, they, they do nasty. They do nasty. Okay, they do nasty. We also have the Empress here. Okay, and somebody um, has a lot of control. If it's a female boss involved in something, in backwards organization or something like that, we, we, we have law here with this uh, empress, whatever that is. Somebody's got a bag of money in their hand as well. Um, it's just sitting on the moon. So there's been some type of deception around. Obviously, we got beast out here. People I don't know what else to say. It's telling itself. Somebody's crazy, cray, cray. Somebody's gonna go to prison for some nasty that they're they're trying to do, manipulate within something that they're trying to produce here. Okay. 
so this projects this is loving caring kind and generous in the upright and somebody's going to do something and put somebody in prison because it could take you back to the law then it'll take you back to the law or somebody works for the law thinks that they're the law because by god i slept with the beast i am a beast and so i'll be a beast to you you're hopefully going to show you what that feels like you freak he's going to trample on you Somebody going to go to prison because actually um, in um, my other reading we had prison energy come out. We have the um, Z out here and this goes back to a shield and a resistance and also a help. We have some type of, we have positive energies coming out in the next 24 hours on somebody, okay? It's going to get some type of justice for some stupid. There was all kinds of money uh, in my other reading. That's, I mean, just about, almost every card was just something about money was there. This is huge. Somebody's, somebody's greedy for gain. I want what you have. I don't care because I'm profane. Um, and somebody's really skilled at what they do because they listen to the, the freakish, nasty, doo-doo energy that's some type of an enchanting stupidness. Um, this also we can go back to a victory in the Hebrew. Um, we got a recovery of something as well. So those of you who aren't dealing with some type of a judgment with the, with the beast, you're just trying to deal with some type of a recovery of something. We do have a recovery room out here. All right, this goes back to um, something that happened out of impulse as well uh, within a matter. But it's also a real impediment that can be overcome. So those of you who are just on a lower level, okay, uh, there's some type of uh, recovery here for you. And there's love here. we got somebody's mother here or grandparent here as well in the outcome. But the Empress represents somebody sweet and kind and caring as well. And because we have the bus stop energy out here, that has a counterpart to it. And we had a bachelor and a bachelorette uh, wording come out in my other reading. Um, it's safe for you to love. It's safe for you to love. The Emperor then would be out here. And there's some type of a protection then that would be around some type of conflict that's going on. Because somebody in the now is trying to freaking... Uh, manipulate something. So we do have messages coming as well or something about messages in the last 24 hours just transformed everything. Something come right up out of freaking hell itself and it's trying to manipulate some stupid somebody's a freak. There's a sun. <laughs> what else you want to bring out here you hold up? Thank you for your protection. Yes, somebody, actually there's prisoner energy here as well, so somebody is a, um, uh, that word came out, I didn't realize that, that uh, somebody was shackled down, but the word prisoner is here, somebody is going to be shackled and bound down with, with, uh, with the chains and fetters. Uh, and go to prison again because it, it was coming out in my first reading and the Empress has the skills of justice within her. Somebody's going to get in. They're going to constantly set their butt in prison, um, even for eternity, especially for this judgment. Acting like a beast to somebody. Act like I'm going to control you. You're an animal. So I'm going to treat you. No, I don't think so. Something, something is here for justice sake for somebody. So we do have a lot of fortune. We do. There was a lot of money. The, the gimmel is rich and generous. She got a big old bag in her hand. Some somebody gonna get back what was stolen from them. We also have the dog here, and this goes back to a um, friend or somebody thought somebody was a friend within this communication. But there's third parties involved in some manipulation out here. There's loyalty situations going on here. Um, the dog is, is also a loyalty card. It's also a yes card if you had a question. Uh, it also can take you back to control. It will take you back to, in scripture, the Jezebel energy. And uh, the dog's going to eat Jezebel up, okay? Uh, they want to they want act like beasts. So, well, then here comes a dog to lick up their, their blood then. That's what they want. That also can go back to um, prostitution if you look up the dog in, in other definitions. Um, you can go back to homosexuality. So some people also got um, same-sex situations going on as well. Um, you got uh, something to do with, um, you know, 
protection is out here with the dog. So if that's in the upright, then that's her. The dog can t also take you back to a counselor type of energy. And somebody does need counseling. For those of you who are just trying to get over some type of just, you know, minor addiction or something like that. And that the third party is just, you know, a physician of some sort. Uh, and you're just feeling insecure and trying to gain power. Then I can read that for you. But we do have some big energies out here on somebody. And you're always going to trample because he's, he's brought out a couple times on a couple videos uh, yesterday that he's going to trample on his enemy and obviously people do this kind of crap is his enemy he they're none of his he's going to cast lucifer right out and he's going to he's just going to get him rid of them they're, they're they're going to be shackled down these people these freaks these nasty gross people that have done some profane things to these children they're going to be bound with fetters and go to prison so thank you you'll hold up thank you you hold up until next time shalom